though. This little girl is, uh, I just took her brother upstairs to take a nap. And, uh, I came back down and pretty much, well, as I'm coming down, she's cleaning up the blocks, which she already put away. They go under there. That's the box, right? Oh, my finger's sticking right there. That's where it goes. Hold on. She already put that away for all the blocks. There were only a couple more blocks that needed to go in there. She put them in there, put the lid on, struggled with the lid for a little bit, and then put the lid on, and now she's putting all the books away. She put the bread that's on top in there, and she's just cleaning up. I didn't even ask her to. She's just cleaning up, picking up all the books. You're being such a big girl, Haley. I'm so proud of you. A lot of times, it's a huge mess because they've dumped stuff all over the floor, which isn't really the case today. There's some stuff here and there, and there's some books lying around and stuff, but hi. hi. Um, but today, it's not too bad, so I didn't say Papa. anything about, yeah, I didn't say anything about having her clean up, but uh, she just automatically started cleaning up, and I'm very proud of her for that. <laughs> just wanted to say that. Guys, I am, I'm easily amused, I will say that, but it's okay. <laughs> Before I turn to you, I was going to tell you all the things that my husband did, that Brett did, uh, this morning that he told me about when he woke me up to tell me he was leaving, not leaving, but he went to his friend's house for a while, which is fine. Um, but anyway, I was, got to, I was getting ready to tell you that, and, uh other stuff, but right as I was turning this on, I realized the dishwasher was running. You can probably hear it, but red light's on. So that's another thing he did. I don't think he mentioned that, but he apparently started the dishwasher. We don't have a sink full of dishes. I mean, I, I don't know if he would have used much dishes this morning, but there's a couple cups there, but I also need to charge this, but so that's another thing, but that's all, the first thing I've told you. Also, I walked in here and I knew, I knew that he had gotten potatoes because of what else he had done. But um, I walked in and I'm like, potatoes! <laughs> I'm silly, guys. I kind of like potatoes and I don't know. I was trying to figure out what to have for like breakfast slash lunch. It's only 10:37, but I don't. We don't really have a whole lot of breakfast stuff. And, yeah, so I might just have lunch, like a really early lunch. But anyway, Brett woke me up this morning, and uh, he informed me that he had, I think he walked Zena. He said Zena's been on a walk, so I'm guessing he took her on a walk, which I never do. So, props to him for that. I really, that's awesome if <laughs> he took her on a walk. Uh, but he said he fed her, I think, and she's outside. And he was going to go feed the cats um, after he talked to me, so they should be fed. He also started supper. Hi, puppy. <laughs> Puppy's in there. Um, there's a roast. I don't know if I should have been or not. There's some potatoes and carrots in there. And there's roast in here. Looks good. Oh, it smells good. Oh. Um, so those are cooking. He said they should be done at like 5.15, so that's exciting. He got that started, which we've had the roast for maybe a week or two. Um, I just hadn't, we didn't really have the money for me to go and get stuff to, like the, the potatoes and the spice packet or whatever it's called, the seasoning packet. But anyway, he started that. He went to the store, obviously. He started the dishwasher. He fed the animals. He let Zena out. Apparently took Zena on a walk. He is always surprising me, and it's so nice, and this thing is, I'm trying to fix this, it's bothering me, it's bothering me, there we go, um, I thought about going and visiting our pastor and his wife, I think it's me and his wife is running it, I don't know if, she, if he's out there too, I don't know, I don't know. but they have a garage sale, a yard sale going on yesterday and today, that I could go, well I didn't say it, but um, I thought about going over to visit him or something, maybe taking like donuts or something, but you don't really have money to just buy donuts. <laughs> and I don't know 
I feel like I'd be awkward if I just went over there to hang out. I'm not good at that. <laughs> I'm not good, good at just going and hanging out with people unless it's like, I don't know. I don't know. But anyway, Zena's outside. Zena! She's not looking over here. But I am, I, uh, I need to do a video. Um, it'll probably, it'll be up before this one. Um, but I need to do my 16 week bump date video. Um, I didn't really have time yesterday, unless I would have done it while the kids were sleeping, but I didn't. Um, kids that I watch. But, uh, I wanted to just kind of be, like, hippie, relaxy today. I don't have anywhere I'm going, um, so I just found some pants. There's something on the floor. Um, found some pants, not wearing socks, kind of got one of my hippier shirts on, braided my hair. Uh, I put this new bracelet that I have. It's actually from China. It was like handmade. It's pretty awesome. Um, I got that on and uh, I wasn't going to do my makeup yet, but I figured since like after lunch or after whatever I eat, um, I'm probably going to do that video. It might be better to have makeup on. So I did that. Plus it looks better for myself. Um, so that's what's going on. I've been ready to have some food. It's a nice relaxing Saturday. We don't have anything we have to do, which is kind of nice. I love having stuff planned. I love being able to go do stuff and have and like have things to look forward to. But it's also kind of nice every once in a while to have just a day off. We don't feel obligated to do anything. Like I had a couple days off this week and I felt like I'm not working. I need to look for a job. <laughs> so I had that kind of in my head all day. But today is Saturday and it's not a work day and I can just relax and do whatever I want pretty much. And Brett's, like I said, he's at his friend's house. Um, his friend has a day off, so he was gonna go over there and hang out. He went maybe an hour ago or an hour and a half, two hours, something, I don't know. Somewhere between an hour and two hours ago, I think, when he woke me up, he was he getting ready to head there. Um, but it's gonna be a good day. Yay, I love him. He's, he's pretty great. Guys, I gotta make this quick because I don't want my food to get cold, but I did find out what to, I did discover a breakfast I could make because Brett got more eggs. Look at all those eggs. Oh, it's so exciting. So we have potatoes, we have eggs. I made scrambled eggs and potatoes, and there's there's cheese in there, and there's ketchup, and, oh, and I just took a bite. I have one I took one bite so far. So first time ever making like fried potatoes. Little pieces of potatoes, and uh, I think it's really good. <laughs> They're nice and soft, and oh, okay, I gotta go eat this. Hey guys, so I wanted to edit my video, and I got a couple things done, and Brett's home now, but look, I got this stuff done, and so happy, so excited. This I'll have to show you later. Brett and I are gonna do our usual video of it. My yum box. All the way from the Ring of Fire. Hmm. What do you think the Ring of Fire is? The Ring of Fire? Yeah. Uh, the Ring of Fire is a, and you're recording this, so I'm going to be as gentle <laughs> as possible because I roughly know what it is. I, I don't want it to be too exact. Uh, the Ring of Fire is a, it runs along a, a fault line. It's essentially just a, it's a colloquial term for a uh, range of volcanoes, essentially, that run along the fault line. It's, uh... And what country do you think it is? It's, uh, in, like, the kind of Southeast Asia region. So maybe we have Asia. Somewhere well, that's in Southeast Asia. Countries. Yeah, that's, that's the ring of fire. <laughs> At least that's the colloquial big. term I'm familiar it's with. It's so big. So I'm gonna open this. I won't open it on camera, but... Because that would be too boring for you guys. But I'm gonna open it. And I'm excited. I actually got this partially by accident. I have a subscription, but um, I've been skipping it every month because we don't really have the money for me to pay it every month. But um, it snuck past me this time before I could think about it. So I have it and I'm excited to open it. But yeah, I won't bother you with the details, but I'm excited. So don't mind the noise. My husband is... Uh, weed whacking outside, just whacking the weeds, just whacking the weed. No, he's got a weed whacker. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you some of the cool things. Um, sorry, I'm just reading the box. 
Um, I'll show you some of the cool things that I got in the box. Um, I got two books, which is probably why it was so big. It has Catching Stars and Sky in the Deep. So it sounds interesting. So two, they're also both pretty thick. Like that's the main book. They're always hardback. The main book is. And then I got a pretty thick second book, which is cool. I got this pretty purple bookmark. Um, this thing that I can hang up if I wanted to. Hey, stop chewing on the stiff. I'm just chewing on these things. Um, I got a bunch of little pins. I got this. I'll probably just throw away. And this is really pretty. I might find a place for that. It says, uh, when in doubt, go to the library. This can go in the trash. It's just the total that everything is. And this pin. Stop! My cat is chewing on this. It's so gross. Look at that. Ew! Gross! Cat, anyway. Oh, and then a bath bomb. Did you guys get smell? But it smells so good. It's pretty thick little. Pinkish, orangish, and color. Alright, anyway, I'll be back. So nice. Hey guys, so um, I just, I always feel so accomplished when the kitchen is clean. That's like the biggest thing. It's, I feel like, well, partly because it's just the easiest thing to get clean. I don't know, maybe it's just my favorite thing to clean. I don't know, but. I always just feel so satisfied when it's clean, and uh, we had Aaron and Riley, two of our friends, over tonight. Oh, I have a video I can watch. Um, sorry. Uh, two of our friends from church came over and had supper. I don't know if I mentioned they were coming or not, but they came over and had supper, and uh, then we played, oh, Brett and... Aaron played a couple games of Summoner Wars. I don't know if you know what that is or not. Uh, thumbs up if you know what it is. <laughs> but uh, Riley, the the girl um, of the couple, just and I just kind of sat there and just kind of sat there and talked a little bit and looked at our phones and we're just kind of bored. Or at least I was. Um, they played two games of that, which seemed to last forever, but. Then we played uh, things and kind of talked, and that was fun. I lost, um, I was losing by a lot at first, but I kind of a little bit, but I lost. <laughs> I was in last place and things, but that was fun. It was a good night. Um, we had a lot of dishes, and we used both crock pots like I showed you. I didn't show you when we ate, um, but I got the dishwasher filled up, and there's only like, aside from the crock pots, there's only like, I think three dishes that I were that I wasn't able to fit into the into the dishwasher, um, so I left those just kind of sitting to the side. I let the crock pots crock pots soak, and then kind of got some other things like wiped down and cleaned up, um, wiped down the the uh, crock pot container things like the outside part, um, and then cleaned both the crock pots and put those away. Finished wiping off the counters and the stove and uh, put some water in the, the three dishes that were left out, like three bigger like serving type dishes. Um, put those in the sink and had those soak. Uh, I think that's it. Oh, and then took out the trash, both trashes. They were both pretty close to being full, so I took both those out to the, the sunroom. I didn't take them out to the garage yet, but they're out in the sunroom. And so the kitchen, the, oh, I can show you. Puppy laying on my feet, so she's probably gonna be annoyed when I leave. But Ugh. I will show you. You didn't see that before, but look. this is all clean. This is where the crock pots were. I wiped that down. This is all wiped down. Looks so nice. I mean, that's kind of it, but it's. I don't know if that's gonna come off or not. Excuse me. That's all wiped down. I just have stuff so. Oh yeah, there's a cup too. But I have that stuff soaking. And that's running that Zana's in her cage. So everything in the kitchen is good. Um, I have the table kind of set back up how it was uh, before they came. And I got me, oh, I'm sorry, Peppy. I got me some water and some popcorn. And I might play my game. Well, I'll play solitaire a little bit. And then, oh, I it. <laughs> my screen is touch screen. I kind of wish it wasn't because I don't like that it is. But um, anyway. 
uh, I might play my game, I might watch some show or something, but, and listen to some music if I play my game and just kind of relax. Like, I've, I obviously changed my hair when I was, uh, like a third way into the, into the cleaning process, maybe a little further, um, about halfway maybe, I don't know. Um, I decided to just put it up in a ponytail because it's just less annoying that way. I, my bangs are still like not quite long enough that they can, they're not quite as long as my hair, maybe like half as long or, I don't know, but two thirds as long, but I have to pin them back and there's just a lot of flyaways when I have like my hair and like braid and it can be annoying, um, but they're up in the pony show right now, they're long enough for that, they're like right there, you see them, there, anyway. This is me saying goodnight, so I hope you have a great, grand, wonderful, amazing, pleopity day, and I will see you in my next video. Good night.